Hi there, I'm Thomas Meyer. I'm 31 years old. I live in White Lake, Michigan. I'm just making this video because I want people to know how I feel. Because I'm going to put this. I feel like nobody really appreciates me, except for my family, of course. People say that they like me, but I know that they don't because nobody ever hangs out with me. I did have one friend hang out with me one time. Well, actually, a few times. Actually, I had some friends. But that was just with me. I want to be able to hang out with a group of people. I know I've done bad things in the past. But that's... I'm going to put this... It's because of what happened to me when I was six years old. Uh, I went sledding, got hit and ran over. I got a closed head injury now. And it feels like people don't... People don't appreciate me. And... I wish people could just understand that I am a good guy I'm not bad at all I know I've made mistakes at oh, let's say when I was little <laughs> and as I was growing up and uh, my last two jobs yeah, I made very big mistakes but I don't want to talk about my jobs. Without so this really get me in trouble. <laughs> I just I don't know. I wish people could just appreciate me for me. For who I am. This I've been trying to do everything I could, or can I should say, to make people like me. Back in 2008, my brother, he joined a business called Shaq Lee. And at first, I'm like, um, I just lost my job, um, I can't get into it. But he said, if I join, I'll make lots of money. So, because of the money that I get each month, I thought, sure, I'll join. I joined. Because I bought some products first, and they were working great. They still do, also. So, after I became an independent distributor, I thought that that would really help me. You know, get people to like me more. To show them that I can do a business by myself. And not have to, oh, say, work for other people because that just gets me in trouble when I work for other people. I try not to get in trouble. Okay, but back on the same. I just wish that. I, I wish that I could get people I could help. I want to help people become healthier, have healthier lives, and also help people oh, build up their wealth so that they can go places. That's also living their dreams. I just, I wish I could do something for everybody. Every time I try to tell people about Shackley business, they just yell out, oh, that's a pyramid scheme. No, it's not. I bought a lot of product, products. Oh, I wish I could get them. I can get one of the products. Hold on one second.
Okay, I'm back. Now this one product, it's a healthy product, but it's not a vitamin. Because Shackley has vitamins and cleaning products. So, I thought because this was a close fit, you know, where I'm sitting at. This right here, it's hand dishwash soap from Shackley. It's liquid concentrate and it's safe for you, your home, and your planet. We also have the uh, dishwasher, yeah, dishwasher soap. They work great. We also got laundry detergent, the laundry soap, the all uh, dryer sheets. We also got lots of great products. Lots of people, when I talk to them about Shaq Lee, they keep saying, "Oh, no, I don't think so because they won't send it to us or those products don't work." And they do work. They really do. I use them all the time. And there's a product called Cinch that helps people who are overweight who want to lose weight, lose weight. Just gotta make sure you drink water too. Because if you don't, so is it the milk product? Or you can mix it with water. It doesn't matter. But if you mix it with milk, you gotta make sure you drink a lot of water too. I just wish I could get people to to just I don't know trust me. Trust that I know that or trust me that I can help them. I'm not a bad person. mistakes in the past again. But I want that all to disappear. Because last year I put out flyers for my Shackley business. Except my brother, or sponsor I should say, told me to put something on the inside of the flyers to get people to open up the flyers because he said that lots of people throw away flyers. Oh, I listened to him. Big mistake. Because I forgot children are not supposed to have those things that they told me to put inside the flyers. And then they called the cops. But Oh, the cops didn't come talk to me. They talked to my brother. And but they said just be careful next time. Now I'm making, I made some new flyers, but I only bought 10 copies of it from the store. I already know, got 10, 10 copies of it. But I don't know where to put them at. Do I put them on people's mailboxes? Nah, they'll probably throw them away. I was thinking about putting them on telephone poles. I don't know if they'll let me do that here in the, in White Lake, because I read online that every city has rules about putting up flyers on telephone poles. Well, I was told by somebody I work with, the best thing to do is just put them on people's cars, you know, underneath their windshield wipers. Because that's what this one girl was doing at our store. I just... I don't know, I guess I gotta believe that I can do something to get my business built up. Because I want to help people. I mostly want to help my family make enough money to get this house that we're living in paid off. So then I can go get my own house. <laughs> then they don't have to put up with me no more. <laughs> but I just, but I mostly want to help people with their health, their wealth, and their dreams. Lots of people that want to do lots of stuff that 
they've never done before that they can't do but with my help they will uh, that's all I have to say just remember everybody I am a good person I know I look kinda crazy but hey I look like Ross Geller from Friends except I'm not as lucky as he was have a good day, everybody.